that, sound, that sounds good. Yeah, below average. You yeah. believe that? I like that. Finally. I like this weekend. But you know what? Hey, we want to we want to tell people that there's kind of a fun thing coming up in sports, right? Family Fun Fest. They're here. Um, it's a memorabilia bus that I've never seen the likes of it before, and uh -huh. we're going to take a little tour of it during the Fox 13 sports page coming up. It's in our parking Very lot. fun. Okay. That's right. Thanks, Mike. Cool. Thanks for being a part of Fox 13 News at 9. Stay tuned for Quick Cast and Sports Page up next. Kyle Busch does what no other NASCAR driver has ever done before. And stick around as Jeff and I take you for a trip on a baseball memorabilia bus. But first, tonight's sports scores. We are standing inside an amazable, amazing portable, I guess historic, uh, moving whatever you want to call it, museum for baseball. Gerard Guzman joins us with the Fan Fest. You travel all over the country. What are we looking at here? This is the Minor League Baseball Museum. It's a collection that houses some of the greatest memorabilia dating back to the 1800s, really um, focusing on the greatness that is Minor League Baseball. Yeah, I see Joe DiMaggio and the Babe Ruth there, but a lot of different things. What sort of uh, items do we have in here? have um, baseball cards, jerseys, have um, a section here that uh, we have mitts, some mitts from the late 1800s. You see the evolution of the game of baseball. I got to tell you, Gerard, I was just looking at these mitts behind you, and I have to admit, in the, well, let's say a few years ago, I was using mitts very similar, <laughs> and you cannot believe guys played Major League Baseball with these things. They have no web. It's like five fingers, and boy, you got to be lucky to grab that ball, but people can see this in your, in your museum. Right, this is a, it's a, it's a great collection and it really does encompass the game and you can really see the, how the game has evolved and some of the, all the great names that have made an impact in the major leagues ha have had to come through the minors. Now this is the fifth year that you folks have been on the road with this, with this museum. It's an amazing demonstration of baseball memorabilia. That's right, we have a few different sections. Um, a section dedicated to baseball in Hollywood, a section dedicated to the Negro Leagues, a um, uh, specific section dedicated to our national spokesman, Nolan Ryan, um, as well. And where can we see this? F fans can actually see this tomorrow, right? Beginning at about 4 o'clock? That's right. Tomorrow, uh, we're bringing the Principal Financial Group Family Fun Fest down to uh, the Franklin Covey Field. Mm -hmm. and come out at 4 o'clock. We have over 20 different attractions, um, batting cages, bounce houses, pigeon cages. Come out. You can get your picture on a baseball card courtesy of Days In. Our own baseball card. That's right. You build right. your own baseball card. <laughs> you guys do more than just show off stuff. You're also trying to help raise equipment and some money for some good causes. Is that Right. That's right. We're part of an initiative called Pitch In for Baseball. And with that, we're accepting uh, new and gently used baseball equipment. And it goes to baseball charities and Little League programs worldwide. Now, uh, Gerard, if somebody, excuse me, Jeff, if somebody brings equipment tomorrow, new or used, what will that benefit them? Tickets to the game? That's right. That's right. They come down to the event, uh, they donate their equipment, and they'll get a two-for-one voucher for, uh, for tickets for a future Salt Lake Bees game. So, and actually, they're pitching cages and batting cages. This is going to be interactive. This is going to be a lot of fun. That's right. And we got uh, another trailer with the Xbox 360 home run derby, so about six different video games. And a big draw a lot of people like is the MTV Rock Band stage. Oh, yeah. Oh, everybody yeah, loves sure. to get up there, get on the guitar, get on drums. <laughs> no, it has to do a lot with baseball, but it sure is a lot of fun. That's right. Definitely You'll set it up. At 4 o'clock, the game starts at 7 against the Fresno Grizzlies, so they got three hours to mess around out there. That's right, three hours to come in and take in all the excitement. It, there is something for everybody. We got a rookie zone for little kids, um, but there is something that's out there for all ages, definitely. Franklin Covey Field tomorrow, three, game, three hours before the game between right. the Bees and the Grizzlies. Franklin Covey, you're going to be right out in front of the ballpark, and That's it's right. free. That's right, all free. But bring some equipment down, help out. That's right. Little League around the world, right? That's right, Little League programs around the world benefit, so. Right on, this stuff's amazing. So thanks for stopping by. We'll look forward to seeing you tomorrow at Franklin Covey Field. All thanks, right. Gerard. Thank you.